what is going on? It's Pyro. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I wanted to take a second and talk about how you can save some time, save some money, and upgrade your Plasma 8 a little faster. Now, as you watch this, uh, <laughs> this might not be the direction you want to take with it. You might want to go at it differently than I am. Uh, you will see that I am not Plasma 8 on everything. <laughs> I'm not Plasma 7 on everything. <coughs> I might be Plasma 5 on one thing, uh, but that's okay. Uh, I was looking to go ahead and jump up the Plasma 8, get my, get my uh, march up there, and just have that 8 star. It was kind of a, an arms race in State 243 to find out who would get it first. So it's uh, literally, I had this going. When the timer hit the reset, zero, 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 zero. Uh, I was ready to rock on this. And so my initial thought was that I would need 100 polymerized plasma. What a name. Uh, <laughs> that is definitely a handful to say. Uh, so here I am going through. And so I guess while I sit here and you watch me click on this for a while, Here's the deal. You only have to have three buildings at Plasma 7 in order to upgrade to Plasma 8 headquarters. Obviously, you gotta have Plasma 7 headquarters. The next one is your barracks, which is good because we all wanna upgrade infantry before we upgrade all those other troop types as it is. And the Hero Precinct is the other, which is good because uh, I believe it's a 6% troop attack uh, increase when you upgrade that. Uh, but right now, uh, that new Institute, uh, I've only got it at a Plasma 5, so I never upgraded it. I did start on it a little bit, and I kind of wish I wouldn't have. But those are the buildings you have to have. I'm not saying this is the best way for everybody. I can understand if some people want to go ahead and have their hunters at, at level seven, possibly even riders. I don't, I wouldn't recommend that. Riders are pretty worthless in this game right now. Uh, but it's there for you. You don't have to upgrade uh, those other buildings right now. So just the three in order to get to uh, start your plasma eight. I'm going ahead and throwing on the buffs here because I want to I want to make sure that I can uh, not use all my speeds. I haven't added up how many construction speeds I'm going to need to get everything to Plasma 8. And rather than pull out a calculator, like I said, it's kind of an arms race here in State 243. We've got multiple people that, hey, it's fun to be on the leaderboard, you know? So they're, they're, <laughs> they're jumping over here pretty quick to try to go ahead and get up to level uh, 8. I'll say as well is I know a lot of people are just maxing out that purification to get the polymerized plasma every time. I'm just not going to do it. I will go up to when it gets to 150 and then I'm going to stop. I don't see the need to spend 150 plasma for three polymerized uh, plasma cores unless I need to get this to 40 right here <laughs> in order to get my last little bit. So I did I did go ahead and, and use it a couple times, but that was just so I get that eighth star. But other than that, I'm not going to go to that level. So once it gets to the 150, I'll just stop. Or wherever I feel like I, I wanna stop for that time frame, I will. And with that, I was not first and I did it pretty quick, you can see. <laughs> I, uh, I got through that pretty quick and I had two people beat me, but that's all right. Hey, uh, I hope this helps you. Hope you save a little time, save a little money. Of course, there's no saving money, Plasma 8. Don't be afraid to like, share, or subscribe.